Okay, you have tattoos on various parts of your body. Yes. No face tattoo, though. No. Why not? Oh, I don't know. I think I just haven't... I think... I don't even know. I probably would do one, maybe, like, on the side. But I don't know if tattoos on my face go with the look that I'm trying to give off. But... I don't think that, like, I would ever say, like, hell no. So, I don't know. I just, I'm starting piece by piece. So, next, I'm going to do my leg, and then I'm going to do my back. But maybe one day. Just curious if that was ever a thought, a facial tattoo. Um, yeah. I actually wanted to get, like, a rose or, like, um, a cross right here. But haven't done it yet. What stopped you? Um... Because you thought about it. I just don't know if, like, I don't want to tattoo my face just yet. Because, like, I feel like it's, my face is, like, a part of my brand right now. And I don't know that I would want to tattoo, like, on my face if I'm still trying to, like, venture out in the YouTube and makeup world. I don't know. I just don't feel like it fits my brand, what I'm trying to do for myself on being on my face, you know. Now, was it just merely a thought? Or were you... It was just a thought. Okay. I didn't yeah. know if you got any closer than <laughs> I that. I thought about a lot, doing a lot of crazy shit, <laughs> like a lot of tattoos and piercings, but I just, I never do it. And what would be the meaning of the rose and what would be the meaning of the cross? Um, the cross is because um, I feel like I'm very connected to God and I'm very spiritual. So I just feel like it's something that, um, you know, I'm really, I really believe in. And then the rose, um, my mom's favorite flower is a rose, so... Just something that my mom would like. And you don't have either of those yet on your body at all? No. I have some roses right here, but that's it. And when it comes to, you, you mentioned spiritual, you, um, you mentioned, I forgot how you phrased it. You're, you're, I'm very close to God and I'm very spiritual. Okay, spiritual. But do you actually follow a religion? No. No, I'm not. I'm no religion. I don't feel like that should be like, I don't feel like, what you're connected to should be put in a box of like, you know, a specific religion. I mean, that's just me. I just feel I'm very spiritual. A cross would represent Christianity though. Mm. Mm. Wait, wait, answer, ask me again. Uh, a cross, like if you were to get a cross on the side of your face, like we talked about, it was a thought. I mean, that would definitely represent Christianity, yeah. I just, um, I guess it would just let others know that like I'm really like that I'm spiritual, but I I'm I'm still in I I don't know exactly how I could explain how I feel about like God and being spiritual. It's like I'm connected to both cuz I was raised to be a Christian, but I don't feel like I'm just stuck on just Christianity. Do you know what I mean? Like I feel like I'm kind of all over the place in what I believe in. But I definitely believe in God. I just don't like to say, like, I'm this or I'm that, you know? And when you were raised under Christianity, was a certain was it a certain denomination of Christianity you were raised? Um, no. It was just... Mm -mm. And were you raised under the roof of your mother, father, both, under Christianity growing up? Um, my mom, she's like, she hits it super hard. She's very religious. Um, my dad... Not so much. Um, I'm actually not even really sure what my dad believes in now. I don't talk to him that much. But I know growing up, he didn't um, like force us to go to church or anything like that. My mom was big on that, but my dad wasn't. What does your mom think of the way you currently think about religion and your spirituality, being that she is very religious, as you described? She does not, she's not very happy with like certain things that I say. Um, when I say like I'm spiritual versus like I'm a Christian and I'm very religious, like she doesn't really like that at all. She's like, no, you're a Christian. I'm like, no, I'm spiritual. Like I, I, I have yet to find what I believe in fully and 100%, you know? Has this caused a rift between you and your mother as far as your relationship with her? Um... A little bit, just because it ventures off more than just me saying I'm spiritual. It's it's also like maybe some things that I do or my sexuality. Um, so it's it's on top of me saying it that she how how I am that might 
cause us to sometimes get into it, yeah. Or, you know, we just have disagreements and different thoughts on it. But, I mean, I'm me, and I'm an adult now, so. I can't remember last time I had you here if we talked about your sexuality. We didn't. Um, it was like a year ago, yeah, I was here. What is your sexuality, just for the record? I am bisexual, um, but it's like... I haven't figured out if I would ever like date a girl. And I know a lot of people are going to be like, that's crazy. You can't say you're bi if blah, 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 blah. But um, I mean, I'm very interested in girls, but girls, women just don't do it for me, if that makes sense. Like I love having fun with girls and I'm very open, um, but it doesn't, but they don't do it for me. Like I could never marry a girl. I mean, unless I found the right one, I guess, but. I would prefer to marry a man. <laughs> so when it comes to women, it sounds like They're women fun. sexually are fun. Yeah. They sexually stimulate you or please you. Right. Okay. Yeah. But there we go. A relationship wise. No, no, absolutely not. Yeah. Just for fun. I mean, I was curious years ago and, you know, in the industry that I was in, as far as dancing, um, you know, you kind of had to be around girls all the time naked. So like, you know just came about <laughs> exotic dancing yes exotic dancing yeah it just came about so you know have you tried to be in a relationship with a female no I have not tried I've always been like absolutely not I've always just been like well we can have fun like but it's not something that I would plan I wouldn't be like let's go on a date to have fun it would just happen like organically like it would have to be natural for me to even you know be into it